just around the corner from Horseshoe Bend, Idaho. Charles will have to tell you about the wonderful things you can buy. Moneta rolls trite is a pretty fair log splitter, but splitting logs is not what she does best. What Moneta rolls trite does best is make hats. Not city slicker hats, you understand. Not fedoras or bowlers or homburgs. She makes cowboy hats. She makes them to measure, every one by hand from start to finish. Her shop is very far from any city, but you'd be amazed how many ornery, rootin' tootin', sidewindin' desperados still manage to find her. You think this is me? Oh, definitely. <laughs> Look like something out of dog patch. <laughs> I don't know whether that does anything for you or not. <laughs> not really. <laughs> not really. <laughs> yeah, but I But you could turn that into a beauty, couldn't you? Yes, that's The process of turning an enormous felt oh, right dome here. into a humdinger of a hat begins with what looks yeah. to be an instrument of torture. Now, you put this on your head, just like this, and this is front and center here, and you pull it down, it'll spring out as you pull it down oh, on your head so that it'll, it'll conform to your head and set it just where you would ordinarily wear your hat. You to tip it off the side a little bit, and that's the way to wear it, and then hold it so it doesn't come down too far because it is kind of heavy and it has a tendency to come down. How's that? What do you think? That's about right, it looks like. Now, if you just, there we go. <clears throat> now you can take it off. There. Now, what have you got? Well, I say when we go out of the hat business, we're going in the wig business. How'd your hair hold up under the hat? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, once in a while, it pulls a few hairs out. <laughs> now, you see, the outside of this is, is actually the number of inches around your head, the size of your head as well as the shape of it. Oh, well, I'll be darned. I've got a sort of irregular head there. Well, not too bad. I can show you some that... <laughs> I don't know what you'd call. <laughs> yes. Uh-huh. All right. Does all this seem a great deal of trouble? Not for what uh, her for customers sure. get. After all, <laughs> boots do not a buckaroo make. Nor jeans, nor a western shirt, none of that. A cowboy is made by a cowboy hat. This is the hat America gave the world. You can't possibly go to too much trouble to get just the right one. I think. So this is a variety of, I think I've got most of the colors in here. The color, yes, after a perfect map of the head is made. And then every other detail must be perfect too. Now, let's see here. This. This is five inches at the front, and it's about four and a quarter at the back is the way it's creased down to. <clears throat> the perfect crown, the perfect brim, the perfect turn, up or down, front or back, Can we go more and on most the important of all, shorter? the perfect crease. Yeah, yeah. yeah, about to there. Okay, Just a little bit. Now this is a telescope crease, and this is what we call a, a ridge runner. This is a horseshoe. Oh, oh yes. Yeah. Hard to find in a store-bought hat. These that days. is right, yes. And this is the Rodeo Cowboy Association. <clears throat> That's a Ridge Rider. How many different creases mm -hmm. are there? Actually, I don't know. Um, it just uh, of the of the conventional creases, there's probably a dozen or so. There is a lot of good looking hats. And you can make every one of these, can't you? Oh yeah, I, I make them. She has made every one of them, hundreds of times, since she learned the art of hat making long ago from her late husband. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah. Oh, that's a well, relic. Yeah, isn't it, though? I think, I think this was made about five or six years ago for this kid, and it looks, it, it looks like it has been probably used to haze the cattle or beat the horse or something with it. I don't know, because uh, this is not normal wear. Here's another thing that you... Well, now, why doesn't he just <laughs> throw this hat away? It has personality. You don't throw something like that away any more than you throw your old fishing gear away or anything like that. You don't, uh, you know, you, you just don't uh, get a hat in this condition overnight. It, it's just <laughs> part of the family, that's all. That's just part of his garb. Packer brims or gambler brims with edges rolled or edges left flat. Bulldoggers, ridge runners, custom crowns with custom telescope or open road or three-finger creases. How often in life can you get exactly, exactly what you want? It practically makes you a cowboy, doesn't it, even if you it never does. heard that? It does, yeah. Yeah, if I see you ride out of here I will, on a white horse, I won't be surprised <laughs> at all. <laughs> yeah, it does.